Once, an engine attached to a train was afraid of a few drops of rain. It went into a tunnel and squeaked through its funnel and wouldn't come out again. The engine's name is Henry. His driver and fireman argued with him, but he would not move. He said, The guard blew his whistle till he had no more breath and waved his flag till his arms ached, but Henry still stayed in the tunnel and blew steam at him. Then along came Sir Topham Hatt, the man in charge of all the engines on Sodor. They call him the Fat Controller. Said the Fat Controller, but Henry only blew steam at him and made him wet. Everyone pulled except the Fat Controller because, he said, but still Henry stayed in the tunnel. Then they tried pushing from the other end. The Fat Controller said, but he didn't help. He said, they pushed and pushed and pushed, but still Henry stayed in the tunnel. At last, Thomas came along. The guard waved his red flag and stopped him. Everyone argued with Henry. They said, said Henry. Thomas pushed and puffed and puffed and pushed as hard as he could. But still, Henry stayed in the tunnel. Eventually, even the fat controller gave up. He said, They took up the old rails and built a wall in front of him so that Henry wouldn't get out of the tunnel anymore. All he could do was watch the trains rushing through the other tunnel. He was very sad because he thought no one would ever see his lovely green paint in red stripes again. As time went on, Edward and Gordon would often pass by. Edward would say, and Gordon would say, poor Henry had no steam to answer. His fire had gone out. Soot and dirt from the tunnel had spoiled his lovely green paint and red stripes anyway. He wondered if he would ever be allowed to pull trains again. But I think it deserved his punishment. Don't you? Gordon always pulled the big express. He was proud of being the only engine strong enough to do so. It was full of important people, like the Fat Controller, and Gordon was seeing how fast he could go. Said Gordon. Said the coaches. In a minute, Gordon would see the tunnel where Henry stood bricked up and lonely. He was almost there when, pshhh, and there was Gordon going slower and slower in a cloud of steam. His driver stopped the train, asked Gordon, said the driver. Everyone came to see Gordon, said the fat controller. While the guard went to find one, they uncoupled Gordon, who had enough puff to slink onto a siding out of the way. Edward was the only engine left. He said, said Gordon. Edward puffed and pushed and pushed and puffed, but he couldn't move the heavy coaches, said Gordon said the Fat Controller. He asked, said Henry, said Henry. When Henry had built up steam, he puffed out of the tunnel. He was dirty and covered with cobwebs, said the Fat Controller. 
When Henry came back, he felt much better. Then they coupled him up, said Edward, said Henry. They puffed together, said Edward and Henry, sang the coaches. Everyone was excited. The fat controller leaned out of the window to wave at Edward and Henry, but the train was going so fast that his hat blew off into a field where a goat ate it for tea. They never stopped till they came to the station at the end of the line. The passengers all said thank you, and the fat controller promised Henry a new coat of paint. On their way home, Edward and Henry helped Gordon back to the shed. All three engines are now great friends. Henry doesn't mind the rain now. He knows that the best way to keep his paint nice is not to run into tunnels, but to ask his driver to rub him down when the day's work is over. We will pull you out. <clears throat> My doctor has forbidden me to pull. One, one, two, three, push. Um, my doctor has forbidden me to push. We shall take away your rails and leave you here for always and always and always. Humph, I never like these big engines always going wrong. Send for another engine at once. All right, I will. Will you help pull this train, Henry? You better have a run to ease your joints and find a turntable. You've burst your safety valve, Gordon. You can't pull the train anymore. Look, it has stopped raining. Trickety truck, trickety truck, trickety truck. You've done it, hooray! You've done it, hooray!